What's good everybody? This is the Game Hunted channel with another episode of Star Wars Commander Empire. Yes, we have plenty, plenty of news in Star Wars Commander. Uh, first of all, I need to apologize if my voice sounds kind of funny, but um, I think I'm getting sick, unfortunately. But that's not going to stop us. We need to talk about the new features in Star Wars Commander, all right? So, um, first of all, <laughs> I need to remind you, fellas, um, it's really not necessary to bombard my YouTube channel, my Twitter account, my Facebook page every time there is a new patch or update in Star Wars Commanders. I know, I know something new is coming, fellas. It's really not necessary. It's really... Uh, if I can just explain you or tell you how many mails or how many messages I got uh, during the last couple days telling me, Dude, there is something new coming in Star Wars Commander. Make a video now. <laughs> I wish I can, but unfortunately I was in most Boston, Massachusetts attending to PAX East. So it was really difficult for me to record a video, unfortunately. But yes, I was aware about all the changes and actually have some awesome, awesome news. Yes, I had the opportunity to meet with the community managers of Star Wars Commander. Yes, we have another meeting. Uh, first of all, I had a chance to meet her in San Francisco, California a couple of weeks ago. And now we met one more time in Boston, Massachusetts to talk about Star Wars Commander. See all the things that are coming in the game. Super excited. I'm super happy that what the developers are doing. And we're, what is more important than Squad Wars? Squad Wars is finally here. I'm super excited. This is something that we were waiting for for the longest time. And finally, we're going to chance to have Squad Wars. But it's really important to understand what do you need to know about Squad Wars. Number one, your headquarter must be head, uh, level 5 or higher. Okay, super important. Some people don't know about that. You, start, you need to start leveling up your headquarter if you want to participate in Squad Wars. And also, number two, you need to have at least 15 members in your squad. Okay, so you need to start recruiting people right now, fellas, because when Squad Wars arrive, you need to have 15 members in your squad, and also you need to have Headquarters 5 or higher. So, is your squad ready for battle? I hope so, man, because things are going to get super, super crazy once that Squad Wars begin. Okay, what do we have in there? We got, uh, we got some trouble in there. We're in trouble, fellas. Definitely in trouble. Let's see if we can do a couple. Put a couple Stormies in there, in position. To take care of this annoying droid deca. I don't want to deploy all these snipers because, you know, that, that could be trouble. I really don't want to sacrifice the rest of my troops. Now we're finally getting close to the base. What else do we have? I know there is some new things. I heard about a new Rancor monster. Like I say, I really don't want to talk about that in this episode. First of all, I just wanted to give you details about squad, uh, how the squad is going to work. Okay. Um... Yeah, and that is something that we're going to be covering in future episodes, fellas. So stay tuned to the channel because there's so many things we need to talk about. It's not even funny. It's not even funny. It actually, it's funny because we're going to have so much, so much, so much fun. Um, a couple of other things. Let's see. Let's see. For the Rankin Monster, uh, there is a believe something. Oh, do you know what? I, can, I cannot give you any details. I cannot give more details. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I need to be ultra careful to with everything that I say because uh, remember, fellas, that, uh, well... If we get any information from the community managers, it's super important for us to respect all the private information about the game. But the only thing that I can tell you is that I'm super excited that the developers uh, are working super, super hard in order to make Star Wars Commander even bigger. That is great news for us because there's so many things that we're going to see in the future. I, I cannot wait to start telling you, fellas, because oh my God, I'm biting my tongue. Look at that. <laughs> well, I can't show it because I don't have my webcam. But the other thing that I want to tell you, fellas, is that a uh, live stream is going to start really, really, really soon, fellas. Okay? I think my platform of choice is going to be YouTube Gaming. The reason is the following because in YouTube Gaming, you guys are going to receive a notification every time I go live. Okay? I was thinking in using Mob Crash. Uh, but for now, I believe the first couple of episodes are going to be hosted in YouTube Gaming. So stay tuned to the channel. Probably this is going to happen uh, by the end of the month. You know what? Yeah, probably next week. You know what? Probably next week we can have our first live stream of Star Wars Commander so we can push a little bit with the Empire. 
uh, need to upgrade a couple of the defensive buildings before squad uh, squad wars arrive. You need to start working and you need to start recruiting some good players because squad wars are here. Fellas, this is the game hunter. I'm going to record another video, another episode of Star Wars Commander really, really soon to talk about some other features. But for now, I really wanted to give you the a quick insight to squad wars. Like I said, headquarter five and also 15 members. So you get it. You, I think you have work to do. Okay. <laughs> you definitely have work to do. Fellas, this is the game hunter i will see you in the next episode take care everybody <laughs>